Hello, here we'll discuss how to get started in creating apps for the iPhone and Apple mobile devices that run the iPhone OS. Now you might ask, how does Flash allow me to produce and publish iPhone apps? So one easy way to get started is create new iPhone OS application. And you'll see that it gives you the proper size and layout for creating iPhone OS apps. Now what you put in the file is sort of irrelevant. The only thing you have to keep in mind is that Apple mobile devices do not currently have the rendering power of a desktop PC so the less intense your applications are the better. The CPU and GPU processing abilities of the Apple mobile devices is not yet really up to par with what somebody might have on their desktop machine. So things might run a little slower and look a little choppy and groggy if you have an intense application with intense animations. Like I said, what you have in the file is really irrelevant, so I'm not even going to be putting anything in here. What I'm going to be showing you is the publish settings. So let's go into File, Publish Settings. You'll see in the Formats tab, everything is pretty much the same as it always been. In the Flash tab, you'll see you have a new selection under the player. So when you click iPhone OS, you'll have, let's see, let's go to Flash Player 9 or Flash Player 10. You can see we can change the Action Script version. If we go to iPhone OS, it's only Action Script 3. Now if you hit the Settings tab here, this is the packager that Flash CS5 comes equipped with that has all the options and settings needed for the iPhone app deployment and you would build it like any other regular flash app and it just requires this new packager when publishing so what happens here is you'll put in all your settings that you get from the Apple documentation once you become a certified Apple iPhone application developer so here you can set your icons here is the deployment tab where you put in your certificate and provisioning file and how you want it deployed it's all pretty much self-explanatory Let's go back to the general tab. When you become an applications, an iPhone applications developer, Apple will give you all the documentation needed and the certificates needed to deploy your app for the Apple App Store. So in the Flash CS5 end of things, that's pretty much all you need to know. Now the more complicated bit would be when you have to go to Apple, which a certificate is needed, which you can get through Apple. And if you need to ask Apple any questions directly, you can go to visit Apple's discussion uh, support forums. So they have a forum set up at Apple and it's the support discussion forums where you can ask questions to see how you can get started with obtaining the developer certificate. And There's two ways you can make money creating these applications. One is to sell the app in the Apple iPhone App Store and two is you can integrate ads into your application there's a company called Graystripe who focuses on mobile ads and that company is partnered with Adobe and those ads can be laid right into your application and they can help you make money now the the applications themselves will only run on the iPhone or the iPhone OS devices so people who are on the web with their iPhone they won't be able to to use your application that you create on a web page per se it would have to be an executable file that they would install onto their iPhone and then they can use the application so that's pretty much all you need to know to get started in creating Apple iPhone OS applications that you can sell at the App Store at Apple good luck